Hello everyone. Today I'm going to walk you through the basics of using IO Manip. Um, this is a basic built-in header uh, pre-directive for C++ uh, that allows you to format your code. Uh, most importantly, it allows you to format your output for uh, command line tools and programs within the command prompt. So to start, we're going to save a file, open up Sublime Text in the developer prompt, and we will save this as iomanip.cpp. So we'll include the standard IO stream namespace std and we'll also make sure to hash include IO manip. Next we'll set our main function to return zero. Now I want to write a program that essentially will just uh, create a ASCII art wave in the command prompt. Uh, this will loop indefinitely, um, so I will start by writing a while loop that is always true. Uh, this this statement here while one will remain running until you close out of your command prompt or until you press control c or control z um, it's not great code but it's fun to mess around with so to start uh, inside this while loop we'll write a for loop for int i equals zero i is less than 10 this is how high the ascii wave is going to be i plus plus and here's where we start to see um, some of the built-in features of io manip we're going to see out set width or set w this is a io manip and this will set the width of the line to um, whatever number is in between these parentheses. In our case, we'll set that to i. Here's another IO manip <clears throat> built in uh, set fill. This will take uh, the entirety of the line and fill it with whatever character you put in between uh, the parens and the uh, single quotes. Uh, in this case, we'll just use uh, the asterisk. And then you want to make sure to end this statement with an empty set of double quotes or an end line. And now in order to run this code, <clears throat> we can do CL slash capital EHSC IO manip dot CPP. Now when we run it, we have our waves, but they're not moving exactly how I'd like them to. So I can press control C to end the program. And I'm going to write another for in this uh, in this while loop, and I'll set this to ten. So I will start as ten in this counter, and I will be more than zero. I minus minus. Set width to i. There's that io manip coming in handy. Set fill to asterisk. And then we'll run this program again after compiling. 
and look at that beautiful ASCII waves uh, provided to us thanks to the brilliance of the IO MANIP uh, directive. So, you know, this is fun to mess around with. See, see the sort of cool things you can do with formatting in IO MANIP. Um, yeah, thanks for watching.